shotgun now. Sims looking over the middle. He's got a receiver, and it's a first down catch to make it. He's going to break. 40, 35, 30. They got one shot on the 20-yard line, and make it four. Back goes Sims. Sims pumps. He's going for everything. Deep, deep for Megan. Touchdown if he's in. Yes! While you served. This year, it's almost been almost an adventure every week. Much of that adventure was provided by Dave Meggett, number 30. The speedy rookie from Towson State shattered a number of giant punt return records. This fifth round draft pick also proved to be the steal of the draft by displaying versatility. For a much bigger play by someone who has more foot speed than Manuel, not a real fleet receiver. First down, a little screen out to Meggett. He's into 49er territory. He's inside the 30. He's inside the 20. Meggett staying in back. Touchdown. Oh, that's a big time play. I didn't see any way that Meggett was going to get into the end zone. Sims has the ball. Sims throws, completes the left side. Meggett out of the backfield 50, 45, 40, 35, 30, 25, 20, 15, 10. He'll score. Sims drops back to the 30, throws a release to Meggett. He's got the ball and the bobbly. It's a good run. Across midfield, 45 yard line. He might make it. He's down to the 35, 25. He's going to go in. Even in the best of conditions, Denver's Mile High Stadium is a most inhospitable place. You've got a pass. You are at a tremendous disadvantage. Gossett punts for Los Angeles. A proven cold weather putter for his years at Cleveland. He drives Meggett deep. Dave Meggett, a rookie who's going to the Pro Bowl, breaks it across the 35. He's not done till he crosses the 40. Get on his feet. Meggett could go the distance. Dave Meggett's inside the 30. No one will catch him now. And the rookie from Towson State takes it the distance with no flags on the field. this Raider team the entire week. He is just named to the Pro Bowl, and when that happens to you, what inspires you to go out and, is to show everybody else this is the reason why I'm going to the Pro Bowl, and make it here just with a great run, keeps his feet and just keeps on coming. That is just a spectacular punt return. Club record for the season, 23 field goals as Jager just hit a 43-yarder to give the Raiders the lead. Megan, who ran back the punt 76 yards, on the way again. And Meggett is finally taken down by the last line of defense for the Raiders, but he crossed midfield. Jeff Jager, the kickoff man, was one of the guys that got him. With Dave Meggett's special teams heroics, the Giants put the Eagles away for good. And the punt's coming down to Meggett. He takes it at his own 32. Runs right. Gets across the 35 to the 40. 45, 50. He's at the 45. He might go. One man to stop at the kicker. He's by the kicker. He'll score. The victory was an important first step towards defending New York's NFC East crown. And the punch coming down to Megan. He takes it at his own 32. Runs right. Gets across the 35 to the 40. 45, 50. He's at the 45. He might go. While the defense searched for answers, the offense tried to keep the ball in its hands and out of the clutches of Randall Cunningham. By halftime, the Giants had closed the gap to 14 to 13. The special team stepped forward to jumpstart the attack, keyed by a sparkling kick return from Dave Meggett. Meggett to the 10, Meggett going left to the 15. Meggett cuts back to the 20, 25, 30, 35. He's got the 40, 45, 50, 45, and out of bounds at the Minnesota 40. The New York Giants would stand alone as the world champions of professional football. In the middle territory, Meggett on the right side, takes the handoff and is tripped. He gets up on his feet, continues to move. 40, 45 yard line. The Giants controlled the flow at the outset and took a three to nothing advantage. But the lead vanished. Oh. <laughs> The parking out the signals has the ball in the pocket. Throws over the top. He's got Meggett. Meggett will get a first down.
can't let up. And they couldn't let up against Maggot. Yeah, and, and the thing that the Giants try to do is always get Maggot locked up against the linebacker. Here you see him against John Roper. He's going to beat him on that little break. Quickly, Giants with the big third quarter. They're within 13 to 10. Maggot was the setup man in the second half, wasn't he, Tommy? Again, that quickness will throw off almost any linebacker. You get him, he's going to check to see if the blitz is coming right here. He shakes Revere a little bit, curls up on the inside at six. At Tampa Bay, these fans must have stayed since January because there were giant fans all over the place. Early on, the punt to Dave Maggot and look at that low medic run. Only one man can beat him. It's Marty Carter. Maggot. Looking healthy. Punt return 70 yards in the first quarter, third and goal from the eighth. Sims feels the pressure, steps up, toss it to Dave Megan, and look at that little Megan run. Giants lead it 7 0. Later in the second quarter, it's third and goal again. Sims off to number 30, and look at that little Megan run. Here on the way to the end zone of the touchdown, and the Giants lead it 14 to 3. Third and five of the 14. Haas avoids Mike Golan. And then look at him, float it to Dave Maggot, 10 nothing Giants on the 14-yard play. Yeah, great job of scrambling by the Haas here, but as you watch that joiner, he spots Maggot right there, and Maggot made sure that Seth took his eye off of him. When he did, he ran by him for the touchdown. Now a 10-6 game, the Eagles are kicking off. Maggot makes him over the 25, makes him over the 28. He cuts back across the field at the 35, and look at that little Maggot run. Look at him, makes him over the 50, and then he just cut. Go, ball. Oh, wait, Tanavis McGee flats the last tackler. 92 yards, 17 to 6. Jubert! The first kickoff return since that Bermuda cliff diver, Rocky Thompson. Of Old Maid's field goal, it's 3 0 Eagles. But Sims to Megan for 50 yards and look at that little Megan run. And Giants up 7 0. They go on a 96 yard drive. Phil Sims to Dave Megan. First down and more. Hard to believe. Then Dave Meggett fields the punt, scoots, moves, and down the sideline. You betcha. Touchdown. Giants are rolling. And if you don't have a bag, use a towel. But the Eagles suffered a giant case of heartburn, thanks mostly to little David Meggett, number 30, who covered every inch of Giants Stadium. And the buck by Berger, a bad one, bounces the 40, takes a Philadelphia bounce. Mega will run for the 31, gets the 40, 45, and the 50. One man back at Berger. Berger slows him down, hits him, and he still takes the tackle. He will score! What a run! Almost 70 yards, Jimmy. While Maggot continued to elude the Eagle defenders, engaging in a game of cat and mouse, disappearing at times behind his massive front line, which paved a blue highway into the end zone for his second touchdown of the day. It played like a throwback to an earlier era of all-around play, rushing for two touchdowns and throwing for another. He's three for three in touchdowns against Washington. Career and all against Washington. In the 424-23 Giants, Dave Brown off to Megat. He fumbles, but recovers at the goal line. Next play, Megat gets the call again. He hangs on to it this time. 31-23, G-Man. This year, but look at that little maggot run. 16 yards, ref helps him make the play, and the Patriots have a touchdown and a lead, seven to three. Kind of its field goal very late in the first half, made it 10-7 Dolphins. Then it's Dave Megan and look at that little maggot run. I haven't been able to say this much, Tommy, this year, but look at him go. Remember the last minute and a half, and Megan brings it all the way up to the 39-yard line. Soon start against Jimmy Johnson's Cow uh, Jimmy Johnson's uh, Miami Dolphins. It's Drew Bledsoe hitting to Dave Megan and look at that little Megan. Go, train truck. Is it a fumble stop? Well, we take another look right here. Megan trying to stretch out. Ball knocked out right there. Goes out of the end zone. Should have been a touchback. Was not called. So they get the break. Battle back in the second half. And Dave Megan made one of the biggest plays of the game, returning a punt 60 yards to bring the Patriots within five.
Dolphins game. Pete Carroll on the hot seat. Dave Megan. Look at that little Megan throw. Touchdown New England against Miami. 34 yards to Troy Brown at 10 3 pass. Team score in the third. The Colts forced to punt. And David Megan takes it in. Look at that little Megan run. Megan could go all the way. There he goes. 37 yards. And look at Chris Kardaki, the punter. He's down. What happened, uh, Tom? Typical, typical of a kicker. Watch how he's wandering around. Oh. Waiting to get hit. Oh, but he did hang in the game. Now in the fourth quarter. Stewart scores from the one. It's 14-7. Now fourth quarter, 14-13 Patriots. Bledsoe to Meggett. Intended not for Meggett, but he catches it and he scores. 21-13 New England. They looking good. Up by eight. A 49. Pats down six zip at recess. Drew Bledsoe finally gets it going in the third. Finds Dave Meggett. Meggett is a man. Sweet weed. Three catches, 29 yards. One play later, Dave Megan needs the end zone. Megan gets his 27th career touchdown. Eight rushing, 11 receiving, seven punt return, one kickoff return. He also has five touchdown passes, and Dave has a quarterback sack. 